Component Buffet, Inconsistency, and Tiny Titans. Should we reroll? Probably Tiny Titans first. Rogue Heart. Don't think I'm trying to play Rogue here. I have a, I have a Nasher's Tooth. I think I'm just going to commit to the Nasher's Tooth. That should be pretty good early game. Uh, inconsistency, I think. Yeah, it's Inconsistency. We just get some nice bonus money. Good enough. I do not want her. I do not want her. Mm, what else do I want here? I'll buy the second guy. I don't want to play Void. I think the team that I have is stronger. Sorcerer and Double Bastion. And then we just go uh, Nasher's Tooth. How much mana does he have? He has 50 mana. That's actually pretty good on him. So he's going to get a bunch of attack speed. Every time he casts, he gains 40% attack speed for 5 seconds. And this stacks. Oh, he has a mana. He has a ZZ Roth as well. Uh, not a ZZ Roth. A Nasher's Tooth as well. This guy's way too strong. He has uh, the Spoon, which gives him enough XP to be level, uh, level 5. Nice, we killed the Nefiri, that's good enough. I think um, I would rather have this guy. Okay, now I have this thing. We're getting the inconsistency value. Getting the inconsistency money. So that is really good because I can just save HP. This augment is so good because you can just save HP. Play the strongest board you can find. And you don't have to care about um, keeping your loss streak to get more money. You just you just keep getting more money. You sometimes win, you sometimes lose. It doesn't matter. You will just always get this nice bonus money. Of course, if you are on a full loss streak, then it's really bad. But you probably won't be on a full loss streak with this ever. Because you can always be stronger than someone who is on a full loss streak. And you probably... Like, if you are on a full win streak, which sometimes can happen if you're just lucky early game. If you have a really strong team. That is also good, because if you're on a full win streak, you don't even need an augment. You're winning the game, right? So this augment is just always good. I think that I value the Swain much more there. Double Slayer. Is that worth? The thing is, it's so much more expensive and it's not even worth, right? Like, currently I'm playing a 3-cost unit and a 1-cost unit. And I would ditch both of them for a 3-cost and a 3-cost. A 2-cost and a 1-cost. So I'm, I'm, I'm doubling my money spent and it's not even that much better, I think. I, I don't think it's much better. Mm, it would be better, though. Okay, I win this fight, I think. Yeah, I think I'm winning this fight, and then I just pre-level anyway, so I can buy both and pre-level. And then it becomes kind of worth, unless he gets pierced. That's really unlucky. Okay, whatever, I'm not buying them. That's really unlucky there, getting pierced in the straight line. Ionia Emblem. I don't think I want an Ionia Emblem. Hmm, 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 hmm. I think I'll just go for a rod. I can play a Zir with uh, this. It's so OP. But the question is, do we want to play something blatantly broken on PvE? That is the question. Honestly, at this point, yes. Because I want to sleep. Shurima. I could hold some Shurima units already. I'm not gonna level, right? I'm not gonna go Gunblade, I'm going Ginsu's. Ginsu's ZZ Rot Giant Slayer. Your Azir is gonna kill everything. Infinite attack speed. Ginsu's ZZ Rot. The ZZ Rot, ZZ Rot is just attack speed. Oh no, it is, it's 30 AP as well. It's crazy, bro. Like 30 AP as well. 30 AP is so much. That has to get nerfed. Like this is 10 AP. It's 30 AP and it's not built out of a AP item. Like, it's just beyond broken. 
No wonder Azir is winning every game. Yeah, no wonder. No wonder. Mm, I'm just gonna chill with these units. I'll just buy her. Another unit. This is really good. Play him. That's really good now. We have three sorcerer. I don't think I ever need this. I don't think I ever need this, so I can level here. I can level and just play another Swain, I think. I think that's the best thing I can do. Ooh, I'm pretty strong. I feel like I'm pretty strong. I think I'm gonna let the puppy die. Just shield the Swains. He's level 4, easy win. We have 40 gold. You can see the augment is just doing everything. Like usually, loss, win, loss, win. And then loss is of course the worst, but win, like this is not good, right? This sequence is not good. You're usually super broke, you have like 20 gold left. Or you, you have like less than 20 gold. At this point. Oh wait, I'm gonna lose. It's just the challenger diff or what? Okay, Loki, I don't lose this. He's gonna burst her, nice. Nice, good job. That was close though, that was really close. Okay, that's really good. Uh, we're not gonna lose this fight. Keep getting our beautiful inconsistency gold, so that's really good. And you get this here as well, right? You get it at PvE as well, I think. It's actually crazy. Alright, so hopefully we get a bow. I'll just go Azir. If I have a beautiful game for Azir, might as well. Two star Swain, not bad. Two star Swain, very good here. Oh, wow. Okay. I should have bought this girl. I got an Ionic Spar. I got another this guy. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Beautiful. We can get beautiful Azir items. Or, I mean, uh, Shurima emblem, hopefully. I can level here. I mean, 200 MS, it is what it is. But that's actually really annoying. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Still 10 trades. How's that work? Didn't I have 10 already? I have eight? Maybe I had eight. Who knows? Doesn't matter, it's fine. Uh, we pop this. We will have three since we have ten traits here. We'll have three of them. We'll be in the book. Last stand. Gargantuan resolve. I don't I don't think I need last stand. I'm pretty healthy. I don't need sorcerer crest either. No, your enemy is pretty good. No, your enemy is better than infusion, for sure. No Shurima emblem. But we did get a strategist emblem. That's pretty good. It's good enough, yeah. I think I just want to play two Tariks. I just on her for now. Okay, it can't be correct that I'm still playing this idiot. That definitely cannot be correct. Whatever, bro. I have infinite money. Losing the fight was good. I have infinite money. I don't really care. I'm just gonna go uh, level 7 here. Roll down 80 gold. Oh, whoop. Another one. Another guy abusing rapid fire cannon when it's bugged. Cool. Amazing, guys. Amazing. Slam gunblade? Nope. I need Ginsu's. Alright, so we get we, we hopefully get a bow on this carousel. Uh, I'll be happy to win this next fight, but I'm not gonna level yet. I think it's worth. There's no unit I need. I mean, there's a strategist. Might as well, right? 
Freaking might as well, might as well. Yeah. I'm sure she's fine, right? Sure. Surely. And then I'll just sell her to transfer items, but I'll probably keep playing her, right? Because they removed Teemo. They removed Teemo. I think we want to play six, uh, six... Six Shurima. Remember, they reworked Shurima quite a bit. That's why it's so OP now. They reworked it quite a bit. Instead of being 369, it is 2469. So you can get... Or, uh, what, what, what was Shurima? It was 3579, right? Now it's 2469. So you get really strong at 6 Shurima already. As send that combat start is already at 6 Shurima instead of 7. And 7 was always awkward to get. Nice, I won this fight. That's actually big. I get huge inconsistency value. I'm second pick. I don't think I'm getting it just because it's on such a... Expensive unit, man. Man, unfortunate. Yeah, I'll just go Gunblade. Break it. Maybe we just go Gunblade. Like, I'm down to try Gunblade. Because I feel like with Know Your Enemy, I already have enough damage. And then I just... Yeah, Gunblade. This year just heals my Nasus. Nasus never dies. And Strategist is going to give me enough AP. Yeah, Loki, it's fine. That's a lot of Nefiris. Okay, I have a lot of money here. It's very good. What the frick are these shops? It's crazy. Alright, GG. Maybe I'll get a 3 star Nefiri for free. Probably not though, huh? Oh, frick. I mean, this is fine. Okay, so we don't have... Man, is just everyone abusing this rapid fire thing? Ah, uh, it is what it is, guys. It is what it is. Uh, so we definitely want the Jarvan, right? He's gonna give us five strategist. Five strategists go buffed, actually. Look at this, 900 shield instead of 800, I believe. Actually, really good. I don't think I need her. Oh, nice. Alright, that's big. That's big. Alright, that is huge. I don't think we need this lady. And um, we can just ditch one Shurima unit right now. I don't think we need this lady. I never need this three stars. Trash. I just go six Shurima. But next level, right? I, I kick this for six Shurima. Kind of hard to get six Shurima, huh? Without Emblem, because you really want Swain. Swain is too good. You really want Strategist. The thing is, Shurima and Strategist doesn't even add or doesn't even work that well together. Maybe we just play four Shurima, huh? Because playing six Shurima, I have to play these two trash units. Might be four Shurima. I'll keep the option open because maybe I'll just find uh, Kasante. I definitely want to go level 8, right? Now I'm not getting uh, the inconsistency value anymore, but again, like, could, do we really care if we're on a win streak? I think if you're on a win streak, you're very happy uh, either way. Alright, so this guy is obviously going to be our main tank. We want him for strategist. We do not need him. He's just a 2 star right now, so that's why I'm playing him. He's good. The thing is, uh, Strategist gives you a huge shield and Shurima heals percentage health. Doesn't really work well together. I got my Ginsu's, guys. GG. I got another dude. I mean, Morello is terrible. Mm, just reforge this rod, I think. Sword is a Sterox. That's not even bad, right? On Nasus? Frick it. That's good enough, for sure. Alright, cool. 
I think I'm just four strategies for Shurima for now. I think I'm just chilling. Next turn, I just level up. This guy is, I think, too weak for me. One star Fiora. Has perfect items, though. But still, I feel like it might be too weak for me. I mean, I have a, a one star as here, but I feel like my front line is just really powerful. My front line is just so good. Yeah, and then she just gets ganged up on. She just get, she's just getting banged. She's just getting gang banged. What? G g g g g ganged up, you know? Ganged. G gang gang. Gang gang. Ice cream so good. Gang gang. You got me feeling like a cowgirl. What? Tactician's tools. Tactician's tools. Radiant relics. No, frig radiant relics, man. Thing is, I already have three items on him. It's definitely not sorcerer crown. It's definitely not lucky gloves. I don't like tactician's tools. Oh, stationary support three. Frick it. This is good. Stationary support three. Let's go. That's a banger. Oh, these are good. These are good. Oh, these are so good. Ay, 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 these are really good guys. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. These are freaking amazing guys. Wow, perfect. Perfect support items. So let me take you through them. Of course, some of them are new, some of them are reworked. Needlessly big gem, the shimmer scale item is now just a support item. No more money interaction, always a 35% bonus increase in damage after the timer ticks down. So that's really good, obviously. Right? And you still get the gold, though. You just don't have the... Remember, it had the gold scaling. If you had 60 gold in the bank, it would give you 60 gold damage increase... 60% uh, damage increase. Look how strong I am. Holy frick. Wait, is he 9 Demacia? No. Juben, Juben guy. Juben, where is he? This guy, Luben. No, he's 7 Demacia, okay. I was like, wow, he's tanky. Ionia Rise. Ionia Rise. Oh, Heimerdinger. I already have Magic Pen, though. I think it's fine. I don't think I need Magic Pen. I don't think I need heal reduction because they, they'll just like like you, you can you can try to heal. I don't think I'll hit three star Tariq. I think it's a huge bait, right? It's a huge bait, man. Rise is good though. Rise is good. A Union Rise is good. I don't think we need that guy. Oh, right, second second item. Locket of the Iron Solari is giga broken now. It gives you a 200 health shield, but also 20 armor and 20 magic resistance for everyone that gets hit by the shield. So it scales really, really well with five strategists because now the 900 health shield has more armor and magic resistance attached to it. GG. And then we have this. This is insane. Every five seconds, heal your team for 7% of their max health. When the holder dies, the healing increases to 14%. And continues for 10 seconds. Oh, Frey, this is so beautiful, man. It's actually too good. I don't know, what do I want here? I guess just a belt. Just want the tank item on, on, on Nasus. Like a Warmox maybe or something? Probably not, though. Probably... Maybe Redemption, even. I mean, I'm looking for a two-star as here. Shouldn't be that hard to find, right? I have to keep rolling, man. There's no way. See, usually you would always play Heimer, right? You wouldn't even think. You would just play Heimer. I feel like I really don't need Tarek, you know? Like, I'm so tanky. I'm tanky enough. I really just don't need Tarek, man. I think. Like, I'm so freaking tanky. And, uh, like, Ionia Rise is, is so good. Ionia Rise is amazing. I feel like this is much better, man. It's much better to play four uh, Shurima, right? Because four Shurima is like five Shurima. Everyone ascends, which is nice. 
Everyone just ascends already. It's exactly what we want. Hear my name and know my strength. I mean, it's just Cassante instead of Nefiri, right? Honestly, I don't even want to ditch Nefiri. I think I feel like I ditched the uh, Renekton. Like, freak Renekton, no? Or do I go six? Nah, I don't go six. Freak Renekton. Freak Renekton. Because Nefiri is based. Nefiri gives us the Darken thing, and level next level, what do I play? What do I play at level ten? I'm going level ten this game. Easily, right? So what do I play? I'll obviously play um, the Aatrox. He's gonna give my main tank Juggernaut, my a my my Nasus Juggernaut, and he's gonna give us double Darkin. So both Darkin weapons are gonna have 50% more effectivity. So I'm gonna get a lot of life steal, Omni Vamp, and health from the Darkin weapon from uh, from the Darkin blade from Aatrox. So this is crazy. But I need two star, two star this guy, right? I need two star this guy. I move the items to him because this Swain is too risky. Swain is too risky here. And the rise is fine. The rise is perfectly fine, right? We're not really complaining about rise. Rise is just doing his little Ionia thing, giving us attack speed and stuff. That's pretty good. Stunning the enemies or making them dance. Here is redemption. Is not that bad. It's okay. It's fine, yeah. Another another Cassante, obviously. This dreaming pool always gives you the right units. What is this again? What is cloak? What what is Zephyr now? I mean, we can just check because I'll go redemption anyway. Oh, even shroud armor pen, yeah. We don't need that. We do not need that. Man, I, I would really enjoy Anasus too. Like, I, I feel like I shouldn't just sit here. Like, I shouldn't just go level 9 without Anasus. Like, I feel like I'll lose so much health. And I'll lose my win streak and stuff if I don't have Anasus too. Like, I might lose my win streak right here. I mean, honestly, I do because he's abusing Rapid Fire on Mila, so. I definitely lose, yeah. Rapid Fire, Mila, Cringe Lord, yeah. At least it's only two rapid fires instead of three. <laughs> he has this though, he could have gone three. It's even better. Nah man, like I, I just need a Nasus, man. It shouldn't be that hard. There's no There's not really a lot of Nasus used. Yeah, there really isn't. There's probably like one two star Nasus used. Yeah, here. That's it, no? There's one one star and another, yeah. Five Nasus. I I, I should be I should hit. I can hit here for sure. Oh, frick. Well, that is lovely. I, I think I play this over Rise, right? I definitely play this over Rise. I just go Rise level 9. This is really good. He has two Shurima emblems. He's gonna go level 9 and hit, uh, hit 9 Shurima. Ah, man. The problem is he gets a free win against me. I would win against him with my support thingy. Why does his Kisante just cast twice so fast and mine doesn't? Probably MF feeding him mana. Do I still win? Do I still win with the Ascension? Nice, nice, nice. Yeah, as you can see, like I have insane combat augments. I have know your enemy and stationary support. That's why I can beat him anyway. I'm, I'm glad I beat him because if I didn't beat him here, he gets a he gets an easier time to go to level 9. And that would be really bad. This game is so bad, bro. What? I mean, there's enough Nasus in the pool. In ranked, I would always roll at 8. In ranked here, I would always roll at 8. If I go level 9 here, it will be because it's PBE and I like I, I don't care. So I, I did... I'm doing the ranked decision, basically. The right decision, right? I'm not trolling. It's just really unfortunate RNG. I mean, honestly, I don't even need level 9 anymore because I'm gonna get 2-star Cassante for free. My level 9 is just a rise, which is not bad. But it's not really impressive, right? It doesn't do that much. So 
So I don't really technically need level 9, so it's fine. Like, I'll have 90% of my team. Because I get 2-star Cassante for free. Because of Dreaming Pool. Dreaming Pool always gives you uh, the unit that fits your board. So it's always going to be Cassante. With 4 Shurima. Actually, it might be a... Uh... Nah, I have so many Shurima units. It has to be Cassante. Is this just the Bastion Emblem? Bastion Emblem is fine. Everything else is trash, right? Morello is good. Morello is actually it, yeah. Morello on uh, MF. Just Morello on MF. Morello on MF, pretty good. Could also go on Jarvan. I think it's safer on MF. Finally. <laughs> that was so dumb. That took way too long. <laughs> that was so dumb. <laughs> that was so freaking stupid, man. Uh, like, Aatrox 2 doesn't matter much, right, guys? Aatrox 2 does not matter that much. He's just there to get fed. He's just there for the Darkin weapon. When he doesn't have items, Aatrox 2, Aatrox 1, no difference. So uh, that's why level 8 and 9 doesn't matter. It doesn't make a big difference. Of course, now I'll go level 9 if I can. But, you know. Like, if I can reach it. But yeah. Like, here, I'm gonna get a, a Cassante for free, you know. Because Dreaming Pool uh, gives you the unit that you have the most units of. So I have one, two, three, four Shurima units, right? And it has to give me a five cost. But I only have one, two Darkin units. So it's not going to give me the Darkin five cost. It's going to give me the Shurima five cost. Always, the Kasante. And then um, it can't give me Strategist. I have five Strategists, but it can't give me Strategist because there's no five cost Strategist. It doesn't exist. So. GG. Easy. I think we're winning this, although he is very strong. He has Morning Light as well, but I do have heal reduction, so that's pretty good. But he has Invoker with Ari, like, he's really strong, actually. I don't know if I'm winning this. Genuinely. Oh, but he's getting Shrek. Man, this Ari is just not what she used to be, is she? Ari is not what she used to be, guys, in the previous set. Alright, we're top 3 guaranteed. Here is gonna give me a Cassante. As I said, it has to be Cassante because like I, I just have the most units of that type, right? That's what it goes after. People used to think it's the uppermost uh uppermost trait listed. That'll be strategist, since there's no five cost strategist, it goes down one, would be darken. But it's actually the it's the other thing. The most units. The trait that has the most units on the board. So even if you're playing, let's say, 8 Fioras, it's gonna give you a challenger, you know? At stage 4. Uh, Fiora. There's my Cassante. Like I told you. Oh, these items are cringe though now. What am I gonna do with those? Oh, I do have a remover. That's pretty good. Because I can go BT on Nasus and then just go Redemption on Cassante. I mean, I don't really like Redemption on Cassante. I just go, I, nah, like, I'll go Redemption or something. So, okay, so the problem, the dilemma we have there is Kassante wants mana items, but Kassante dashes around, so the Redemption is going to be far away now from my team. And we really want the Redemption on Nasus. But, you know, we can't give Ionic Spark to Kassante because we have to have it on our tankiest unit, which is Nasus. So that's the dilemma we have. This guy's rapid fire abusing, so I can't win. As always, guys, rapid fire abusers, you cannot win. Are these both rapid fire abusers? No, the other rapid fire abuser died. That is pretty neat. Uh, 62 level, 62 level. 62 level? I think I will just level here because. 
there's no point risking it. There's a there's a Scion. I mean, I could play a Heimerdinger. It's still gonna add a lot of damage. Nah, I don't have money for Heimerdinger. I'm just gonna add this girl. I don't have a money for Heimerdinger. Can I beat this guy? This guy has kind of a weird team. Has a little bit of everything. Wait, he's playing Master Yi. Oh, he's playing Master Yi. I, I, I saw Pandora's bench, so I thought it's TF guy. And then I was wondering, I was mid-game, I was wondering why he isn't abusing Rapid Fire, because that's what all the Twist of Fate guys do. Oh, this guy somehow lost. That's kind of based. I, I don't think we'll hit 3 star. Oh, we could just play uh, GP. GP for the utility, for the attack speed. How much attack speed is it? The ship? 35% attack speed. And immunity to crown control. Is it, is it, um... Hmm. Or is it rise? Oh, double rise? Okay, sure. If I have two rises, two rise, you know. Like, two star rise is better than GP for sure. Also, rise is better anyway. Like, it's CC. We just want CC. We don't care about CC immunity on our team and attack speed. I mean, CC immunity on our team is good, but... Uh, I'm kind of beating this guy, aren't I? His Fiora is really strong, though. Oh, frick, I'm not beating him. Oh, wow, Fiora is insane. Yeah. Fiora is super insane. Maybe two star rise will be able to win. I don't really know how I can win here. Maybe a Shurima emblem, a lucky? No. No Shurima emblem, Sunfire, Aatrox too, but it's a Sunfire. That's pretty bad. That is pretty bad. I think it's just Archangel. Sunfire is pretty bad, bro. Can we get a two-star going? Nope. Nope. So I think it's Archangel on Rise. Healing, enemies dance. That's pretty good, right? Frick it. Archangel on Rise. Like, who else would get Archangel? Not Cassante. Man, this guy, this guy is really strong. Like, it's not just the abuse on rapid fire. I mean, he's he's double abusing. Like, he's he's just fully going rapid fire. Because usually people play either Nila rapid fire, triple rapid fire to abuse the rapid fire cannon, or triple rapid fire uh, Mordekaiser, whichever one they hit. But he's just going both. He found two uh, Vanquisher emblems. He just goes both. Yeah, yeah. Not much we can do. I think it's just the third place, isn't it? Oh, we still have that one star Nos at uh, this guy. That's actually hilarious, isn't it? Aw oh, man, there's my rise. I don't have money for this now. I don't have money for him. I'll lock, I guess. And maybe get lucky. I'm gonna shift sides. Far away. Maybe we can just kick out the Fiora if we get lucky. Nah, I'm focusing the... Okay, I'm against the ghost though. Maybe I can beat the ghost with some ghost bugs. Ghost bugs. Nah, the Fiora just kills my dummy, man. I don't have the damage amplification. Oh, the Fiora died though. Okay, we're chilling. Are we chilling? Okay, we are chilling. This guy lost. The, the Fiora is winning against the... The rapid fire abuser. That's good though. I, I hate these rapid fire abusers, man. Turbo cringe. Alright, we have our whole team two starred except for Aatrox, but as I told you, he does not matter if he doesn't have items. I'm just gonna go, go for another item on this guy and try to kick out uh, his main carry or something. Maybe we can kick out the Aatrox if we can. If we can do that, that's big because Aatrox getting kicked out means I don't think that the thing will work, right? The Darken. Passive will not work, I think. I think it will straight up not work. It will not get revived. It's like removing a unit out of the game. Oh, 
Oh, Blue Buff Cassante is insane. It's the best I could have gotten. No, the ping difference. Now my Ionic Spark is on the wrong side. I think I lose this hard now. I'm gonna kick the, uh, the, the Aatrox though. Why is my... Oh, my Azir just walked up because of the kick. Mm, that's really bad. Nah, she still absorbed the thing. Oh, she's, she's CC'd. She's CC'd. Nice, she died. Okay, we can win. We can win. And I moved away my dummy. That's good. And then this guy won. I think he fought me and won. Oh, he's, he almost has three-star Nila. Did he just hit? He's gonna hit, isn't he? Maybe while he's rolling, I can uh, try to kick out his guy. <clears throat> okay, okay. The Aatrox is getting kicked. Maybe it works. Maybe it's just gonna delete the Darken passive. That would be big. That would be big. No lifesteal? Oh, it still went. No, no, no. I don't think it did. I don't think it did. Oh, no, it did. It did. It did. It's still into her. It's still inside of her. Look how broken she is. Look how hard it is to kill her. Oh, man. He can... Okay, so he can revive. He's healing back to full every time. Okay, nice. He got CC. Let's go, guys. We won. We beat the rapid fire. The broken rapid fire abuse. Nice. Stationary support 3. One of my favorite augments already. These little dummy augments are always fun. Not too bad, guys. We got the perfect items, though. I don't think there's any item that would be better than these three support items for Shurima there. That was actually insane. Subscribe to the notification bell if you enjoy these TFT videos. Also, make sure to leave an algorithmic comment and an algorithmic like down below to support this video in the YouTube algorithm so I can get some more views. And I'll see you next time. Peace.